Turning now to weather, uh, John, we're starting off the day with a little bit of rain in some portions yeah. of the state, but it's really shaping up to be another great day. It is, yeah. You want to grab the sunglasses. You won't need them on the way to work, but as far as heading back home, you're going to be looking at a pretty clear and sunny sky. Satellite and radar, mostly cloudy skies over a good portion of the state, but also tracking more of those showers. Seeing a little bit of the clearing already when it comes to cloud cover in the northern portion of the state. Going to the northwest of the metro over Carroll, and Carroll County even still going over to Wall Lake. It's a little bit more of that light isolated shower activity. Same story for Guthrie County as well, headed towards Stewart. But then the further south you go, you still have a chance for more of that more moderate rainfall. Looks like mainly west of Winterset. Also, as we go get over Lorimore as well, as uh, west of uh, 169, we're seeing a little bit more of the more moderate rainfall. It gets to be pretty spotty. Notice it's pretty just much a line of that moderate rainfall and surrounding that will just be light to more pockets of moderate rainfall like over Van Wert and even south of Sheraton right now going over Centerville, even as we go further east over Bloomfield as well. But it's not going to be an entire entire day kind of set up for the rainfall. It's just going to be throughout the morning over the next few hours expect that to thin out and completely dry out as we go throughout the morning as the temperatures are going to be climbing back up in the 70s by the noon hour and will only be in the mid and upper 70s for our highs later on today underneath the sunshine. High pressure is in control and what that's going to do going hour by hour going to clear out the skies as we go later morning hours, especially by 9 10 even going the noon hour. We're going to be clearing up especially long and east of I 35. So central Iowa and eastern Iowa clearing up. Still going to be a, a little bit more of that moisture holding on further west. That'll lead to that cloud cover sticking around a little bit longer, but it does clear up. We'll be mostly sunny to partly cloudy as we go into this afternoon. For tonight, we stay clear. We stay dry. You're not going to be waking up any morning showers throughout Thursday. This is 8 a.m. jumping to the noon hour. It's going to be a mostly sunny day. The wind's picking up a little bit more, about a 10 to 15 mile per hour wind from the south. And as we head into the rest of Thursday, not going to be looking at too much cloud cover until we get into Thursday night. Mostly cloudy as we go throughout our Friday, and that's going to bring a chance for some isolated showers and isolated storms Friday and also Saturday. Now, as far as planning out your weekend, it does look like as of right now, at least the timing Saturday morning. But that is that still can change as we get closer to the weekend. So definitely keep an eye on the rain chances, but also those temperatures back in the mid 90s Sunday, feeling like the upper 90s and even possibly into the triple digits.